All right, we are going back to that breaking news that we are following. Uh, we've seen 200, at least 200, 200 rather, bikes on the roads right now in Miami Gardens right now. And we do know that there are two separate groups. The good thing here, I guess, if we're looking for the silver lining, is that we're seeing regular bikes. We only saw maybe one motorized bike. Right. Uh, but this does pose somewhat of a threat for drivers. But we have seen law enforcement keep an eye on this. Nobody's been injured. No one's hurt. They're watching them from a distance. They're following them to make sure that everything goes smoothly. And this is something that we see year after year. So compared to years past, uh, this seems to be, I guess, less chaotic. Well, for as drivers. Alex said, mostly peaceful and so far no arrests. And we haven't seen any confrontation like we have in years past and again this does appear to be peaceful right now but again when you have that many bikers on the street they're not on their bike lanes they're taking over the entire street yeah. uh, that does po pose a hazard to other drivers that are on the street at the same time on our roadways let's move as sky 10 right now is also above the second seat now here in miami gardens and appears uh, I just spoke too soon that they were confronting a driver. I couldn't see from that video, but my producer was telling me that there was appeared to be some kind of bicyclist and driver confrontation. Uh, we don't see that play out on the screen right now. Uh, we're going back and forth from both of these groups. This again, you know, it, it, it's hard to not talk about the the danger and the hazard of what we're seeing right now. Um, because again, there are motorists on the street and when you have a bike, you're supposed to stick to the bike lane and right. unless it's a sanctioned event where they close the streets off, that's where you're supposed to stay on your bike and uh, drivers are having to navigate this and this does pose a hazard to those that are using these roadways and trying to get home or trying to get to a the dinner or, or wherever it is they're going on our roadways but uh, we're going to keep watching this police again watching this at a distance but so far no arrests and no reports of any violence around that's a good thing right now so we're going to keep watching this for you and bring you updates as they come into our newsroom